everybody welcome back to my channel so I wanted to show y'all what I am making for my lunch today I'm going to bake some of these chicken tenders that uh, came from my last Instacart delivery for Will here's the package uh, these were from the the Aldi delivery that he sent me couple weeks ago. They have a Kirkwood brand. I've been eating them. You can see the package is open. <laughs> and they are so good. So it says to cook them on 425. Heat four minutes and then turn them over and heat four to six minutes longer. But I have cooked them before and um, it did take them longer than, than six minutes or four minutes on each side to cook. So what I'm going to do is Put them in the oven and let them cook on five minutes. Let, let them cook five minutes, then I'll flip them over. So let me go ahead and stick those in. I have my potato already baking. I pre-cooked it in the microwave for one minute. I don't like microwave cooked potatoes, so I just kind of pre-cooked them, and then I finished baking them in the oven. But if you cook them for a minute or two, they still have the baked potato flavor and uh, they will bake in the oven a lot quicker. So look what I got from the food pantry yesterday. I am so happy. Just got a huge load of potatoes. They had so many potatoes and beets and onions. So I got all of these potatoes plus the one that I have in the oven and all of these uh, sweet potatoes, which I absolutely love. And I love this size. Y'all, it's so hard to find this size. And a big old zucchini. I'm going to cook that. That will probably be my dinner tonight. Here's some more of the potatoes. And look, y'all, they had green tomatoes. So I'm gonna have some fried green tomatoes. I don't know if I'll cook those tonight or another night. I got two bags of tomatoes. Yeah, they're starting to get spoiled, so I better go ahead and fry them up. And then I got this huge bag of onions. Lots and lots of onions. I'm going to make me some big old onion rings. <laughs> and a squash. Jill said it's a spaghetti squash which I've never cooked. For some reason, Mama and Daddy never grew um, winter squash, so I never saw her cook a spaghetti squash or an acorn squash or any kind of squash other than the yellow crookneck squash, in which she cut up and fried. Um, but I'm going to go online and, and find a recipe for this. I'm pretty sure you cut it in half. I don't know if it has, it probably has seeds in it that I have to dip out. Or y'all can leave me um, instructions in the comments on how to cook this squash. And and uh, is it a spaghetti squash or a butternut squash? And then, um, she was still hadn't gotten around, y'all, she works all the time, bless her heart. She still hadn't gotten around to making her apple pie, so I said, well, you better let me bring home some more of these mudzu apples and, and cut them up and get them vacuum sealed. So, y'all, I got my work cut out for me. She makes sure I stay busy. <laughs> so I'll be back when my dinner gets ready. Better get these potatoes off the stove top. I got to quit lollygagging around, y'all. You won't believe this, but I am hooked on another murder trial. Oh, Lordy, I cannot stop watching it. It is so, so mesmerizing. Um, the name of the woman accused is Melody Ferris, M-E-L-O-D-Y-F-A-R-R-I-S. And this happened in a little town down in Georgia. Um, actually, I think they lived outside of Atlanta. I don't remember the name of the town. Maybe it was Alpharetta, but they had... Um, I will leave the link to today's uh, part of the trial, which, and it is live, in case y'all are interested. You'll have to go back. I think it's been, the trial started about seven days ago. So 
you'll have a lot of catching up to do, but it is very interesting. So I'll be back when my lunch gets ready. Okay, I believe my chicken fingers are done. Let's see. Turn the timer off. Turn the oven off. And I'm pretty sure my potato is done. It, it has to be. <laughs> I'm going to eat it whether it is or not. I do burn them a little bit, but that's, that's just fine with me. I like my food burnt. Yeah, the potato is nice and soft. It's got that nice crispy skin on the outside, which I love. I ran out of tin foil, which is not a problem for me because I like baking my potatoes without any foil on them anyway. Y'all look at this potato. Nice and crispy. That's going to be so good. And my burnt chicken fingers are going to be so good also. See how many do I want to start with? I'm pretty hungry, so. <sighs> I'm, I'm sure I'll eat all of them, but I'll start with four. Okay, so let me get my potato cut out. And decorated. That's what I call it when I put all the fixings on it. I will be eating this crispy skin also. I am so happy to get these free potatoes. Y'all, that's a lot of money nowadays if if I would have bought these from the store. I found a, it's in a town called Roosevelt. I need to call about it, I found it online. They say it's at a French speaking church, so that's probably um, a Haitian church. But I, I believe it said it's Baptist. I'm gonna call and see if said everyone, everyone accepted, no, um, no requirements to get the free food, but I got to call and see if I need to make an appointment or um, if you just stop by, how that works, but I don't need food pantry food right now. I still have a lot of food left from my last Instacart, so I'm, I'm doing good. I had just run out of the vegetables. Those seem to always go first because I eat so many of them. Just a little salt. And I do have sour cream. Oh, I wish I hadn't got stuck on this trial because then I can't get anything done. It's filmed live. I mean, if I do miss some of it, you know, they start early in the morning. If I do miss some of it, then I spend half the day re-watching and trying to catch up. Do y'all put chives and all of that on your potato? I mean, I would if I had them, but I don't usually keep chives on hand. This would have been good with some fried green tomatoes, but this is just lunch. It's not a big dinner, so I'm just going to eat this and it'll hold me over until dinner time. So I hope you enjoyed this little video. Y'all don't worry about me. I realize I'm not uploading as many videos as I have in the past, but I'm still just, um, you know, taking it easy, making sure my tummy stays healthy, doing all the things that I need to do to keep, keep my tummy healthy and helping my daughter and, and babysitting and helping her with laundry and the kids and taking um, the kids to take an Ife to dance and taking Issa to Taekwondo, you know, all those things. Uh, she needs the help right now and that's what I'm here for. So y'all please give me a thumbs up and share. And if you're new here, I would love it if you would join my YouTube family. And y'all just keep on coming back.